Hello to all of my viewers. This is Dr. Dawal Mehta, and today we'll understand how to run seemingly unrelated regression in R. In this method, a GLS method is applied to exploit the correlation in the errors across the cross section units. The random effect model results in a particular type of correlation among the errors. It is an equicorrelated model. In the SUR model, that is a seemingly unrelated regression, the errors are independent over time. But correlated across the cross-section units. Read this line very carefully. Errors are independent over time, but correlated across the cross-section units. Covariance of UIT, UIT, comma, UJS is equal to sigma IJ if T is equal to S is equal to zero if T is not equal to S. Assume that there are four firms, firm one, two, three, and four. The coefficient estimates obtained in the previous model were under the assumption that the variance of firm 1 is equal to the variance of firm 2, variance of firm 3 is equal to the variance of firm 4. Means the variances are equal of all the four firms and that the errors for firm 1 and 2 in the same year are uncorrelated. That is the covariance of the error of the covariance of the error of the firm 1 at time period t and the error of firm 2 at in the same time is 0. Seemingly unrelated regression estimates are obtained under the assumptions that variance of firm 1 is not equal to the variance of firm 2 and covariance of the error of the firm 1 at time t and the error of firm 2 in the same time period is not equal to 0. Now let's see how we can run this in R. So for this we will go in R. First of all, we will have to import the data set. So we'll go in environment, import the data set from Excel. The name of the data set is panel data. Click open. So we are having year, firm, profit, investment, and capital. The number of firms are four. Uh, here it is, uh, four firms are there. Press import. Yeah, four firms are there. Now we will uh, attach this data set into R by the command line attach the panel data run. Will require some libraries, some packages. So tool install packages. Make sure your internet connection is on. So run uh, LM test that is install this package lm test by pressing here then you will have to install t series and plm and then system fit now you will have to activate its library so that you can use all the functions of this packages so library lm test run t series plm system fit now we will convert this data into the panel data by the command line p data is equal to p data dot frame panel data Indexing is to be done according to the firm and year. So this is firm and year. Let's convert it. Run, run. So this is your panel data now. Now we want to run the seemingly unrelated regression. The command line is system fit. Investment is my dependent variable, tilde, profit and capital. Independent variable, method is sur. Data is p data. Run and run. Now just see, four equations will be formed. Why four? Because the cross-section units are four. So, sure estimates for one. So these are the estimates for the first firm. Then for the second firm. For the third firm. And for the fourth firm. So what is our interpretation? It means that all the cross-section units have its own value of SSR, MSC. Uh, MSC should be less than RMSC. R squares are different of all the firms and adjusted R square are also different. So the regression equation for all cross-sections are different. So remember, though different regression equations look to be unrelated yet it, it is assumed that they are related through the error terms in seemingly unrelated regression 
So this is how you can run seemingly unrelated regression in R. For more videos on econometrics using R, kindly subscribe to my channel. You can also refer my playlist in which I uploaded videos on data science, machine learning and artificial intelligence. Please don't forget to like and share my videos. You can also follow me on different social medias. Link given in the description box.